That's funny. Like, yeah, the same yeah. the same thing does happen with older generations. Yeah. If you if you look up freaking a settings on a on a page somewhere, they'd be like, "Oh my goodness, how did you get into this super hidden thing?" Or just like using Apple Pay. It's fucking it. Apple Pay's kind of. I'm, I don't think a lot of people are like like I didn't know like I haven't used Apple Pay. I to, I put on a credit card on on the Apple Wallet recently. I'm a fintech, bro. I've never. I have a credit card. Yeah. For like I've had one for a year. It's my main one. I've never swiped it before. Oh yeah. Yeah. Apple. Yeah. I just fucking just scam that bitch. So starting after the pandemic. Did that start? No, I was. I've been using. Apple Pay since college. Man, most people went cash I was using Apple digital. Pay before Apple Pay. I was using Google Pay for a little bit. That shit was whack. <laughs> payments it was called Android Pay. Payments, payments, payments. It's everybody yeah, everybody's so gonna many, get the payments, man. So many people getting money in that little uh FinTech in the, bubble. In the, in the, yeah, it's like you fucking scan your Apple Pay, so Apple gets a cut, then Square gets a cut, or whoever. Give it. And then like some other comp- Visa, and then Visa, Ma- dude, Visa and Mastercard have been buying up every single crypto slash pay now or buy now pay later. They're acquisitioning like a mother, bro. And, and like no one really good. talks about it, but I'm I'm kind of like deep in these like niche, not really cool crypto headlines. Visa and MasterCard are buying every single payment service that you could get and tying it to crypto. Nice. It's crazy. I was talking, I was talking to Skylar and this kind of this kind of Meldrum? Yeah, on Instagram. What? Sometimes we chat. How's he doing? He's doing good. He was um oh, I don't this? know, we didn't talk that deep. But we I was like, um he's never heard of Cardano before. Yeah. Didn't even know it existed. And I was like, whoa, you seem like a guy that would, maybe it would have heard of it. <laughs> it seems like the person that when someone says about it and get introduces you then you know all about it yeah like you should be telling me about this stuff and he said yeah i haven't been doing any research so i just all i told him was like just look up blockchain content on youtube and just start there to like get a foundation like, I would, dude i would start with hoskinson whiteboard man like i mean he, i was he gonna do that but like he doesn't really know what ethereum is he doesn't really Not really he yeah, got so, left back in blockchain era in Tucson. Kinda. So I was like, "All right, what's the easiest way to like?" What is the easiest way, dude? I was thinking. I was saying first understand blockchain, because then yeah. if you put money on top of that. Then, because I can talk about crypto all day, but unless you understand blockchain, it, it's still it's tracking. Like, it's fucking. What do you even? Money. What do you even suggest someone watch? I just said binge blockchain content on YouTube. YouTube. Something will come up. Just a freaking, just a little checklist of what people buy and where it goes, man. That immutable ledger. Take a break, yeah? Let's take a break. 